right guys, so today I've got a Fitbit Charge HR. Um, you can see the strap is a little broken here. And so I got on Amazon and this is actually, um, it used to be my wife's, but my son has been wearing it and I actually had to cut an additional hole in the strap for his little wrist. So that's why it tore. So. Um, I got on Amazon and I was able to find a size small medium, I believe, for the Charge HR. Um, he decided he wanted red, so we're going to put that on there. I'll uh, post a link down in the description of this. Uh, it comes with a whole new band, and it looks like it also comes with the tools needed. So, little tiny screws in a bag. And some color instructions. And can't tell if that's a special driver. Uh, so we got a flathead, and this is, I don't think it's a Torx, and I don't think it might be like just a little tiny micro Phillips, um, but a little pry tool and um, yeah it feels about the same the, uh, the original is a little bit softer a little more flexible but I think it should hold up just fine all right so for first step looks like you need the little Phillips screwdriver and the little pry tool. And on the back side, there are four little tiny screws. So we'll get those out. All right, I got the screws out and now it's saying to use the little plastic pry tool and pry up carefully between the rubber of the band and the electronic module. You can see these um, these little metal lock things. That's what you were trying to pry to release because they snap into the housing. Look at that little tiny battery. Okay, now with the new band, I'll set that one off to the side. With the new band, I'm just gonna pull the protective film off the lens. A pair of tweezers. And it looks like it should just snap in. All right. I'm gonna to try to show you this. Um, so the button side of this here, this button, you gotta make sure it's fully seated and then when you slide this inside the new band, you gotta make sure to kind of pry out on this because on the band, the button actually goes on the outside of this housing piece and then just presses on the little rubber um, that's how it maintains its watertight seal. So we'll see if I can get that in there like that. I'm going to try it with the button down so gravity hopefully holds it down. Oops. 
doesn't appear to want to hold it down. See if I can maybe grab it with my tweezers and pull it out while I push that in. So the battery on this is dead uh, because he hasn't been able to wear it. So I'm going to go put it on a charger and get it charged up and just verify that it works. All right, so all finished up. I uh, got a charge. You can see the heart rate monitor is flashing there. Um, the display is orange now. The original one had a little bit of a green tint to it. Um, this one's orange, so it's kind of neat, but only 14 steps today. But overall, the fit and finish is pretty good. Uh, you get a little bit of contrast with the original black plastic there, and I think it's going to work out well. Again, post a link to this replacement band, and they've got mm, probably seven or eight different colors to choose from. Um, but I'll post a link down in the description to those uh, for What it is it's pretty good value not too hard to Replace if you've got a broken strap or you just want to get a different color for yours or change size But anyway, thanks for watching guys um, If you like what I do give me a thumbs up uh, hit that subscribe button and We'll catch you on the next one